Hello sports fans and welcome. Welcome back to the Guru Show. I am your host, the Guru of Sports. <laughs> First of all, I want to say thank you for the lovely introduction and we have our great, great musical guy, Guru, Ray Guru, with the music. That's my brother also. Thank you. Thank you, Ray Guru. We appreciate it. <laughs> this week, I don't have my little helper with me, but he will be back next week, and he will be on the Guru Show. Even though that he doesn't want to be on the show, he'll be on the show. Guaranteed. <laughs> Cody! Cody is here! Hello, Cody! How are you today? My friend... <laughs> Cody now has about 135 followers on Twitter. Thank you for following Cody on Twitter. Thank you for following the Guru on Twitter. And, like I said again, follow us on Guru's Daily Shorts on Facebook. You'll see all this stuff. Highlights of the show, the show itself, and you'll see me and Cody. <laughs> A great combination. <laughs> Okay, let's get right to it. Thursday night was another beatdown, and this time the victim was the San Francisco 49ers. Arizona went into San Francisco up to Levi Stadium and just beat them down like they usually do. Anyway, we've proven two points and two theories. Thursday nights are for beatdowns, and Arizona's defense is really, really good. That defense is amazing. And I'd like to tell you guys that you don't want to mess with the Arizona defense here. Now, in, when, once they're starting to get rolling and they're back on track, hopefully that they can do a little bit better. <laughs> okay, now. Got the Thursday night beat down out of the way. First thing I want to tell you. People ask me, why do I wear this crown? The guru wears the crown because the guru now is another champion. Champion of fantasy sports. The guru did something this past week that no one has done before. I've done it now for the second time in my fantasy career. I actually went undefeated in my fantasy baseball league. 24 and 0. Perfect. Just like the Guru's picks are perfect. Last week, we had a really, really good week because we were very perfect in all our picks. Going perfectly. Nothing wrong. No, no picks that the Guru made last week. What's wrong? The guru is always right. He's perfect. In every sense of the word. <laughs> Get out of here. What was that? Get out of here. Get. Anyway. Now. I want to talk about the poo-poo of the week. I cannot believe this. And I know I... I... I just feel really bad about giving this team the award. But the poo-poo of the week has to go to New England. Yes. New England, you really poo-pooed this week. There's no, no, no right answer for this. Poo-poo of the week is supposed to be a really big, big, big joke. Just like the show and the family. Yeah, just like the show and all the things in here in, that we talk about here on the show. No. Poo poo of the week has to go to New England because New England just really, really poo pooed it up last week. Anyway, get out of here. Tom Brady is back. Tom Brady is back. And I feel really bad for the people of. Cleveland because I don't don't just don't go down to the to the to the game. Don't go down to the game. Because guess what? 
Tom Brady is going to ruin the Browns this week. Anyway, since we talk a little bit about picks, let us go to the picks. Okay, first off, we've mentioned it. Tom Brady is back. And we're going to go with New England versus Cleveland. And we're going to go with New England. <coughs> Chicago and Indy. Hmm. <sighs> we're going to have to go with Chicago. <coughs> Miami and Tennessee. Hmm. Let us see here. I'm going to go with an upset and go with Tennessee. Baltimore and Washington. Hmm. You can see in the background, there's a Washington jersey back there. I like both teams. I like both cities. Great cities. But I might have to go with Baltimore. Minnesota and Houston. <laughs> that Vikings defense is amazing. Minnesota. <laughs> Pittsburgh and the New York Green team. Well, like I said, we cannot say real actual teams when we're doing the picks. But Pittsburgh. Got to remember in that Pittsburgh game, Le'Veon Bell, my buddy. Le'Veon Bell is back. He's just going to destroy New York's team. Anyway, Denver and Atlanta. I want to say one thing about Atlanta. They have been very, very surprising. Very surprising this year. But I still like the world champs. You got to go with Denver. Cincinnati and Dallas. It's a tough one, but guess what? I think I'm going to have to take Cincinnati. The Los Angeles at Buffalo. Hmm. This one, very tough. <laughs> but I'm taking Los Angeles. New York against Green Bay. New York Blue team against Green Bay. Green Bay is at home. Green Bay. <coughs> Tampa Bay and Carolina on Monday night. Hmm. Carolina's banged up really bad. And they haven't really looked that good. I don't think that they're going to lose that game. Let me go with Carolina. Unfortunately, we have to go with this game because we didn't mention them all through the show, but Eagle Fan is back. They were off last week, and unfortunately, they're going to be back again this week. They're going to Detroit, where they took a really, really big Thanksgiving beatdown, and they looked like the Thanksgiving turkey last year. <laughs> But, this is a hard choice. I'm going to go with Detroit. <coughs> the last game I want to talk about. <laughs> this is a classic. As you can see, I'm wearing an Oakland Raider jersey. The Raiders are back, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, the Raiders are back. I just want to say that I love the Raiders in this game. They're playing the San Diego team that just been beat up, and, just, and now they're just, it, they look kind of dysfunctional at times. But the thing about it is that you still got Phillip Rivers, and even though the, all the stuff about talking about getting rid of Phillip Rivers and all, but you have to go with the Raiders. 
I want to tell you something. I always thought about this. The Raiders are just, you know, it just seems to show that years and years down the road, no matter how you feel about the Raiders, the Raiders are always there. And you know what? The NFL is really, really good when the Raiders are good. I want to tell you that I really like the Raiders. Really like the Raiders in this game, and I just wanted to go with the Raiders. Anyway, we are going with the Oakland Raiders. And I want to tell you also. Is a pirate. Blustering in from when you hear this, it is like the national anthem of the Raiders. Swaggering you have to stand up and put your hand over your heart and acknowledge the greatness of the Raiders. We're going to go with about his head. the Oakland Raiders to beat San Diego today. He growls as he storms the country, a villain big and bold. It brings tears to my eyes when every time I hear this. As he robs them of their gold. This is the national the anthem of the Raiders. Is a raider, anyway, pillaging just for fun. I want to say thank you. Knock you and thank you for dropping in and, and checking us out today. And won. Thank you for all your support. And just remember, follow me on Twitter, Goat39. Follow Goaty. Say hi, Goaty. <laughs> follow Goaty. Black Goat39. Follow me on Facebook, Guru's Daily Shorts. We're going to close the program with the national anthem of the Raiders. Thanks to LA to the Max. Appreciate you, Guru Sun. Thanks to the little Guru who will be here next week. I want to say thank you for everything, all your support. And we appreciate you. Until next week, is I, the Guru, champion. And I say, the Guru will see you real soon.